everybody and welcome back to Lunch Bunch for ages birth to five. We are going to read another story today and today is going to be Care Bear's Grumpy Bear Troubles. Grumpy Bear was always my favorite Care Bear. So that's why we're going to read a Grumpy Bear story. We hope you're going to enjoy this story time with your lunch. Grumpy Bear and his friends were on a picnic. The sun was shining, there were no dark clouds in the sky. They sat on a big red blanket and there was a basket full of treats. Champ Bear reached for the last cupcake. He took a big bite. Yum, said Champ Bear, but he didn't realize that Grumpy Bear had not eaten one. Champ Bear ate Grumpy Bear's cupcake by mistake. Grumpy Bear was very quiet. Wee! Cheer Bear cheered from her swing. Champ Bear sat down on a swing. Grumpy Bear opened a book. I don't feel like swinging, Grumpy Bear said. Let's play catch, said Cheer Bear. She threw the ball to Champ Bear. Champ Bear held up his glove. Grumpy Bear threw his hat on a cloud and walked away. Jumping rope is fun, said Champ Bear. You should get a trophy, shouted Cheer Bear. Your turn, Champ Bear called to Grumpy Bear. No thank you, Grumpy Bear said. He sat under a tree with his arms crossed. Is Grumpy Bear sad, asked Champ Bear. Maybe he needs a nap, said Cheer Bear. He can borrow my pillow and blanket, said Cheer Bear. I know, Champ Bear said. Grumpy Bears loved roller skating. The three whooshed down a rainbow. Grab on, Grumpy Bear, called Champ Bear. We're a train, Cheer Bear shouted. I don't want to be a train today, Grumpy Bear said. Did your laces snap, asked Cheer Bear. Do your wheels not spin, asked Cher Bear. No, 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 said Grumpy Bear. Are you mad at me, Champ Bear asked. Grumpy Bear gave a small nod. You took my cupcake, he said. Why didn't you tell me, asked Champ Bear. Grumpy Bear shrugged. I'm very sorry, Champ Bear said. Champ Bear gave Grumpy Bear a hug. Talking made it better, Grumpy Bear said. It's good to share your feelings, said Cheer Bear. The sun is still smiling, so now let's have some fun, Cheer Bear said. Since Grumpy Bear was feeling better, the four played baseball, they jumped rope, and they laced up their skates. They even flew a kite. It was a great day after all. And that's the end of our story. We hope you enjoyed this story with your lunch. And we hope that you will come back next week for another Lunch Bunch story time. We hope you're enjoying summer and we can't wait to see you back at the library soon. Have a great day.